So when I first started working, uh, I used to work in a factory and in that factory there'd be signs everywhere saying this is how you should lift, you should squat down, you should make sure you have a straight back, use your legs to lift. And that was the advice for, from 20, 30, 40 years ago about how everyone should lift. And we, we always thought that keeping your spine protected was um, the best way to do it by keeping your back straight. What we're finding now is that that advice does not lead to people getting any less back pain. And actually, if you observe people who um, lift with a, with a straight back, what you find is that those are the people that tend to already have back pain. If you observe people that don't have back pain, actually, they tend to lift with more of a stooped back. So they'll, they'll still squat down, but they'll, they might lift a bit more with their back uh, slouched over. So what that seems to say is that when you're in pain, you might change your posture a little bit. You might, you might be a bit more upright. But if you're not in pain, you go back to this, this flex position. Those people that had back pain and changed the way they lift, when their back pain goes away, they actually go back to lifting with a relaxed back again. So it seems to be the pain that changes the posture rather than the other way around. So the, the advice I now give is that actually when you're lifting things up that seem quite light and quite manageable, you should be quite relaxed and you shouldn't, shouldn't really think about that straight back posture. Just get used to bending with a, with a rounded back and, and comfortable with it. If you're lifting something really heavy, you might change your posture, you might adapt to that. But those everyday items like picking up your phone off the floor or picking up a really small box, be relaxed, let, let your spine curve, and that's really safe. There's nothing wrong with that at all.